Well, I didn't think I would be doing these things as a kid. Um, that's for sure. I was interested in technology. I read a lot of books. Um, so I was obviously interested in science. I mean, this is, not, this is hardly going to be surprising. I was interested in science fiction and technology. You have to tell the truth because there is someone <laughs> who is yeah. listening to you, huh? Yeah, my mom's right there. She can, <laughs> she can call me out on this if it's not, not accurate. But um, so I, I guess the, the thing that was maybe um, most significant from a philosophical standpoint was that uh, when I was about maybe 12 or 13, I had somewhat of an existential crisis where I was like, I was like what, what is the meaning of life? Is life just meaningless? Why are we here? What does it all mean? And um, I read a lot of books on religion and philosophy. And, um, and then ultimately, the, you know, I read this book, uh, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, which is great. Um, and, and in that book, that book is really a, a, a philosophy book that's disguised as humor. And the point that Douglas Adams makes is that the, the real difficulty is understanding what questions to ask about the answer that is the universe. Um, and that, we, we, that, that really we want to, we want to have, it's, it's, it's essentially, a, it's, it's like a philosophy of curiosity. Um, of, of saying, well, what can we do to find out more about the, the nature of the universe and, um, and the meaning of life? And so it, it, that's, that's the sort of foundational element. And then from there you say, okay, well, if we want to find out the meaning of life, we have to expand the scope and scale of consciousness. We have to go out there and we ex explore the stars to, to know what questions to ask um, about the universe and, and understand the universe. And that's that's my core philosophy, um, and 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 so from that it was like, well, we have to make sure that uh, Earth is good, so we have to have sustainable energy. Um, we um, we want to build technology to travel beyond Earth, and uh, that's it's, it's from that sort of core philosophy that these companies uh, arise in, in most cases. Um, you can say, how does Twitter help with that? <laughs> <laughs>